Hey guys, it's Don't Be Fail here. Just looking on the RuneScape homepage, and they've released information on what's happening next week. Apparently all bots are getting banned, and over 1.5 million botting and gold farming accounts have been banned. Which, I mean, this is fantastic news. Finally, Jagex have actually listened to their players. I mean, the amount that everyone, well not everyone, but I suppose a lot of people go to the forums and rage about the bots, yet Jagex do nothing about it. I mean... They claim to ban so many hundred thousand bots each, well, each year or whatever, but I mean, you look at the game and it's like, no. Look around. 98% are bloody bots. But I think it's fantastic that they're finally doing it. And I mean, they've got rewards. I think it's kind of a bit overpowered, some of the rewards. It sounds a bit retarded that I've said overpowered. But I mean, Tuesday, this all happens next week, but they will be... Triple Slayer XP and Faster Munster respawns. So everyone's going to be Slayer, which I think in the game might be massively crowded of people slaying. But anyway, at least Necreals won't be full of bosses this time. <laughs> Plus one. Anyway, Wednesday, Castle Wars Day. Tickets earned from winning games will be triple the usual amount. I think that'll be fantastic. Because, I mean, I don't actually know how many people play Castle Wars now but i haven't played castle wars in ages and i think triple tickets will be win but anyway first day distractions and diversions day basically bonus xp well penguin hide and seek will give you double points which i think is epic but i just think a load of the things might be a bit like i think it's too much like evil tree triple experience is it really needed i'm pretty sure you get a shit ton of xp for it anyway and triple XP and increased final rewards for shooting star. I think that will be amazing for my mining. But I just think it's a bit too much. And then familiarization. You will receive the lucky charm and ingredients box. Instead of having to choose both. Then on Friday. Souls Day. Um, you will receive the triple amount of zeal. I'm interested how empty Soul Wars will actually be. Because, I mean, once it like 80% of Soul Wars, it's actually botters anyway. But I think it's an amazing update that Jagex have done. And I'd like to see how it happens. I think this has happened, well, happening mainly because, well, RuneScape used to be number one free to play on, free to play MMO out there. But it got overtaken last night by League of Legends. So I think this might be why. And it looks like the game might be looking towards a better future. Maybe. Let me know what you guys think about it anyway and spread the word. Cheers. Please rate, comment and subscribe. And remember, don't be fail.